Hey guys, Shebear 1000. Today we're going to be checking out this smartwatch. It's made by Hype. It was bought at the Dollar General store. Let's see what this thing's all about and what it can do. Okay guys, what we have here is we've got this um, smartwatch. It's made by Hype. It's supposed to have an alarm, phone calls, call history, contacts, calendar, a pedometer, plays music. Um, so, you, I mean, it's supposed to, you're supposed to be able to monitor your health, uh, sleep monitor. Um, let, let's check this out and, and see what it's about. It's for tablets and smartphones. Now, I've never understood these things because you got to have your phone nearby for, you know, to be able to use this thing. So, I don't understand it. Let's open it up and check it out, though. Okay. Got a lot of upcoming videos this week, so... Hopefully you guys will stay tuned and check them out. I've got another, um, I've got two more of the uh, $1 um, potato chips that I've been doing. And I'm just about done with all the the uh, varieties they have on that. So, let's open this up here. Let's see what we've got. So, of course... There's your USB charger. Takes the same kind of charger as Android phone, which that's what I've got. And we've got our book. Holy crap, that is a book. I think Worn Peace is not this long. But, okay, there's that. What else we got here? We've got a quick start guide. And we have the watch. Like I said, it was 20 bucks. I figured it was worth, you know, worth it to make a video on. Alright, there we go. Alright, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to read up on some of this. And, um, we'll go from there. Okay, guys. This watch is going back to the store. Because, let me tell you why. First of all, this thing is, well, it's junk. Um... A lot of the functions on this watch, you have to uh, use the Bluetooth notifier, right? Okay, well, let's go. And it's just, it's a pain in the ass. Okay, you, you got to have Bluetooth notifier. Please install BT notifier app and remote device, okay? back. See this thing it Alright. Now let's do that, okay? Now in order to do that, you gotta scan the code, right? Okay. Alright, you gotta scan the code. Alright, so here's the code. Let me show you what happens. Alright. Now we're gonna scan that code. If I can hold it still. There. Okay, now, let's open that link, and let's see what happens here. This happens every time. This is the fourth code scanner I've tried, and I've tried it on different codes, like on that, and every code scanner I've tried brings it up on other codes, brings it right up. It won't bring it up on this, so how the hell can you use this? if their QR code has exceeded its monthly scan limit. So I would have to wait or find out when their month is up or whatever and then try to get it scanned before everybody else does. So there you go. So that is fucking junk. That's the junk that people are selling out there. And people think they're getting a deal. That's why... 
I do these reviews for you guys. So you don't have to go out and spend your money and then you get shit like this. So we're, this is going to go back, but it's still going to go on YouTube as a review. Do not buy this. Hype. Smartwatch. Don't buy it. It's junk. I mean, I understand it's only 20 bucks, but you pay 20 bucks and you, and you can't use the main features, the reason why you get it, you know, so you get notified of a message or or of a text and or of a call you can't use the camera app on it you can't use or the the yeah you can't use the camera app you can't use the uh nothing without that that's stupid so if you're guessing two bear claws down yeah you're right because that is stupid they're selling that stuff and they can't even afford to have their customers be able to scan the code that you need. It tells you, it tells you in, in the quick start guide, it tells you right there. And in the book, it says the same thing that, no, it don't even tell you in the, in the quick start. Yeah, it does. Right down here in the quick start guide, right down there at the bottom. Note for Android users. You should download and run the BT notification app prior to pairing with Bluetooth. Well, number one, see this tells you prior to pairing, the book tells you to pair it first, but either way it doesn't matter because you can't get it. You can, that's what you get. You get this shit right here. And I know, I know it's not the code scanner, I know it's not my phone, it's none of that crap because it'll scan any other code. Any other code I've scanned with four different scanners, they've all scanned perfect. And, you know, but anyway, prior to pairing with Bluetooth, well, it did pair. And that was kind of a chore. Uh, also, after pairing with Bluetooth, your smartwatch will ask you to sync date and time. Press confirm. It never asked me to do that. Also, it says... Alarms set five different alarm ringtones. I checked that out. It's got three. This thing's junk. Don't buy it. So that's my review for this piece of shit. Don't spend 20 bucks on it. I understand. Well, it's only what do you expect? Well, I expect it to do what it says it's going to do for 20 bucks. I don't care if it's 20 cents. If it says it, it's going to do all this stuff, that's what I expect it to do. Not, well, yeah, it should do it. I'm right. You're right. It should, but it's only twenty dollars. I don't give a shit. It says it will do it when I pay twenty dollars, twenty cents, twenty thousand dollars. I don't care. It better do what it says it's going to do. Everything, not just some of it. Especially the main reason why you get it. You know, I'm not paying twenty dollars for an alarm clock when I got one right here. It's stupid. So anyway guys, there's my review of the Hype smartwatch. That's H-Y-P-E smartwatch. That's it right there. You see that at the Dollar General store? Don't waste your money. It's fucking junk. So anyway guys, that's why we do this. So, so you, you know, if you're thinking about getting somebody, especially for a gift or something, and then it's junk and you, you know, it's like, wow, they hurt my feelings. They never use that watch. Well, no, because they can't, <laughs> you know. So, I don't know, guys. I'm boxing this back up. It's going back. We're getting our 20 bucks back. And we'll get something else to review. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. Shea Bear 1000. The myth, the man, the legend. I'm gone for now, guys. Thanks. Bye-bye.